as I'm wandering around town, I notice this uh, kind of pagoda, which I guess is a uh, Buddhist Buddhist monastery. Uh, Buddhist simply because <laughs> I saw the, the swastika looking symbol a bit earlier. And here it is. I wonder if there's any objections to me going inside and having a look around. I guess not. So here you can see the kind of uh, the temple thing. I'm just going to go and have a look around. Uh, I don't know what it is. It looks kind of like it's a uh, monastery of some kind. Anyway. These uh, Buddhist temples are, are different from the Taoist ones because they're not so uh, extravagantly decorated. So the the Taoist ones tend to have lots of like images of dragons and so them. <laughs> images of dragons and that kind of thing. Over here is an old, must be the old front gate, which is, looks like it's now out of use. Uh, I don't know why. It's always cool to put them through the gate. We're just not big enough for two cars, I guess. Ah, so anyway, pretty cool. And then again, this will be a big pagoda. Gouda! Right, Wally Wally Wah! Time to head out. Okay. <coughs> Let's see the one other strange, uh, well, strange remnant of times gone by. And that's a disused railway crossing. So over here, coming up on the right, the sign that says, uh, uh, I guess it's a un unsignaled level crossing, followed later up by this sign that says, stop, look and listen. I assume it's in that order backwards with <coughs> the now non-existent railway track. There's the same signal on the other side there, there. And over this way, it's mostly been covered up, but it does exist further on. Oh, okay, I've got Mr. Grumpy on the back here. Okay, I've